guys, welcome back to my channel. Hi everyone, sorry. So in today's video, I decided to go very, very, very easy on the eyes and it does amaze you to know that I use just one eyeshadow palette for this look. Like this is the palette. I've had this palette for a long time and I did uh, an unboxing with this palette and the colors in here. They're super pigmented and just so beautiful.
So at this point guys, I already applied um, the same concealer on my lid. Only this time I applied a lot and I'm going to use this as an eyeshadow primer. Now our first color is this neutral um, shade. It's a matte um, color and I'll just be tapping that on my crease area using this fluffy brush for set my brow bone with powder to avoid any sort of creasing so the very next color I'll be picking is that brown shade and I'll be applying it in the outer corners of my eyes extending it into my crease blending everything together with the first color and I'll go back in with the first um, color I use with the same brush to sort of diffuse any um, harsh edges like I'm doing right now and I'm also using the same concealer I used initially on my lid as a primer to coat my crease right now. And I'm using that angled brush I used to define my brows to um, cut my crease. I'm just taking my time to do this process. So for the eyes, you're going to need two stick brushes and I'll be applying those um, eyeshadow they are both shimmers the first one I'm just picking up the color and applying it gently on my lid and I'll be using the second brush to pick up the second eyeshadow color and I'm doing the same process and I'm also going with another steel brush picking up that um, shade that's as close to uh, a dark eyeshadow and just put it in on the outer corner to further you know, smoke that part of the eye and I'll also pick up the brown shade and further define that color grace so it's like more obvious and I'm blending all the harsh lines out and I'm going to go back with that last um, shade like I'm doing there to just further diffuse any harsh lines around that corner And this um, liquid liner is from House of Tara. And I'm going to be doing a wing liner, so I'm just taking my time just so I don't make any mistakes. And if you watch me closely, I'll be looking at the other liners so I don't get it wrong. But one liner is always finer than the other. You guys know the drill. <laughs> And now my favorite mascara is from um, Younger Beauty. I'll be leaving their link in the description box below if you want to shop their products. And this um, gel liner is bomb, you guys. You have to get one. I think it retails for about 2000 naira. And yeah, I'm just applying some chunky glitter underneath my eye. And I'm going to use uh, mascara to separate my bottom lashes. This one is from Zaron Cosmetics. And for my lips, I'll be using that um, brown um, lip pencil liner. It's also from Zaron Cosmetics to define my lips and using a nude um, lipstick in the middle. To smudge this all together and voila. And to set my face, I'll just be using this Zaron Cosmetic Perfect Finish, spraying it on my beauty blender and just pressing it down um, to remove any of those cakiness that I got from the powder. And I'm also applying my normal face powder you know, to just make everything even. And to highlight, I'm using this <laughs> eyeshadow from RLG Cosmetics. From that's the Tokyo Makiwa um, palette. That shade is so beautiful. You can use it as a highlighter. You can also use it as, uh, you know, an eyeshadow. That's what it's for originally. But I just love to use it. I used it on the client recently, and it. It was so beautiful, I had to just use it on my style today. And I'll also leave the link in my description box to their website in case you want to get the product as well.
and that's it for this week i hope you've enjoyed this video so far don't forget to give this video a thumbs up right now if you like it